Hey, it's just so Trish, and it's Wellness Wednesday. Bam! All right. I kind of had my rant on Monday how I was feeling, and um, I let myself slip right back into doing Trim Healthy Mama. <coughs> um, it's just easier, and to be honest with you, Bulletproof Coffee kind of owns me. I was thinking about like, and I still haven't decided, my cat's going to drive me crazy today, um, of like going back into like Weight Watcher mode with thinking with a forethought of like Trim Healthy Mama style or just stick with Trim Healthy Mama. I don't know. I can't even begin to tell you. I don't know. So pros and cons. Maybe this will be a pros and cons video. I drop weight. And I think I drop my most weight with Weight Watchers. <clears throat> it's just what it is. Um, I didn't really... I think I've done the inches. <clears throat> and I dropped... <clears throat> I haven't gotten rid of this yet. More inches and weight on Weight Watchers. But it gets into... They get very anti fat and then they have a lot of sugar in there because a lot of stuff that has no fat has sugar it's just the way it is and this is a lot of points just saying it's a I mean it's a it's a butter and MCT oil so I don't you know it kind of deters me there but I know it works but then I get, like, I don't want to be so fat crazy. Like, no fat, no fat, no fat. Because I know fat is healthy. <coughs> In moderation. I also find I eat more vegetables when I do Weight Watchers. But I don't on Trim Healthy Mama. So, I don't know what I'm going to do. And then there's like a new Weight Watchers. There's my girl, I have a girlfriend doing new Weight Watchers. And she's like, I lost six pounds in one week. I'm like. But then in the back of my mind, there's a study I read that said, any more, your body cannot metabolize more than two pounds of fat per week. Anything more than that, you've metabolized muscle. Or you've, you know, dropped liquid weight. I don't know. I do not know. I know that. I should probably do a more official pros and cons of, you know, Weight Watchers versus Trim Healthy Mama. I know that if I'm not in the mood to count points, that Weight Watchers is a dead. And I know, um, I know that with Trim Healthy Mama, I'm just, just keep going, just keep going. You know, you can just kind of keep going. Um... I do think, like, I'm just one of those people that have to change things up every 60 days. So, I think I should go back and look at i got to find my little book and look at what I lost in the 60 days on Weight Watchers Hardcore versus what I lost while well, I didn't lose any weight the last two months on Trim Healthy Mama. But I went down in inches. So, I don't know. You know, and this is as after I've made, like, the, there's something, find it on Pinterest. If I find it, I'll put it in the description. It's like chicken, broccoli, ranch, chick, <coughs> something. I don't know. It's something like that, but it's good. And then I always make my kids a side of butter rice. So they have a crossover and I eat an S meal. But that's all I eat are S meals again, again. So when I did Weight Watchers for 15 years ago, for the first time, it was like a food, just like, aha moment. Because I didn't know what to eat. I thought eating pasta was diet food. I really did. So, I don't know. Um, and I learned, like, about adding fiber in your diet. I mean, it was good stuff. It was just like, Oh, this is how you eat. Look, my kid's writing on the wall is totally distracting me. Who else lives with that? 
I don't understand. I mean, it's it's on that wall too. I have a one year old that loves markers. And I don't understand we can't keep them away. She loves writing. I give her her own stuff, but she likes to write in everybody's schoolwork. All right. So, <coughs> one of my girlfriends got on to me because I wasn't drinking enough liquid. I admit I wasn't, but because of like this post nasal drip, anything cold just sends me into a coughing fit. Hence, I haven't been doing shakes. I haven't been drinking a lot of Good Girl Moonshine because I like it cold. I just have not been drinking much. So she really challenged me. She's like, you should be drinking half your body weight in ounces. So that puts me about 84, just over half a gallon a day. I'm not doing it. I wish I was. I'm not doing it. I'm close. So in order to make it easier for me, I made a half gallon of Good Girl Moonshine. All right. I just haven't been getting the um, vinegar and the ginger and lemon right. And I will a lot admit, I've been using little crystal light packets. And I'm finding that kind of over sweetens everything and it's not as good. And I think that's been kind of sending me on a slow path back to wanting all the garbage is because I have that aspartame. I'm allowing aspartame in my body. So this one here is half a gallon and I drank one of those yesterday and that's it and that's 60 something I can't think it's still early nobody's up that's why it's quiet um, ounces and I should be around 80 so that's 20 ounces shy maybe my 8 ounces of coffee counts so um, I need to do better but I figured if I have them made and ready to go it's easier for me to drink <laughs> so I want to tell you I've been skipping out on doing just the ginger and I've been using tea so I like it because I can get the tea to give me a flavor that I want without going into the crystallite the powdered junk stuff and yes I'm calling crystallite junk and I use it from time to time my favorites are these if I can find an Amazon link, I'll put them in. But to be honest, they're cheaper at the store. Amazon seems to be very overpriced on Celestial Teas. Unless I find something decent. So I'm buying these about $3.50, 4 bucks a box. When they go on BOGO again, Sister is clearing out the shelves. So one of my favorite ones is the Peach Tea. Now, I don't think this one has... No black tea. So here's the big thing. Some of y'all are like, I do not like tea. You don't like black tea. There's so many different teas, it's not even funny. Black tea is what you don't like. So in this, it has orange peel, rose hips, hawthorn, chamomile, peach flavoring, and other natural flavors, which means you don't know, probably junk. Um, blackberry leaves, hibiscus, peaches, citric acid and paprika for color to do this I did three tea bags and I asked actually I threw in a oolong tea bag in there too because oolong per tea I think it's 60 calories you burn so there's a 60 calorie burning rate with this that I'm drinking today another one of my favorites <coughs> is a red zinger red zingers are my favorite it is hibiscus, rose hips, lemongrass, peppermint, orange peel, natural flavorings, which is garbage, licorice, which is amazing. I like it because I don't like licorice. Lemon, verbena, and wild cherry bark. I love this. With, with it sweet enough, this stuff is refreshing. But that is because of the red hibiscus. Okay, and seriously, the red hibiscus doesn't. That's like an ornamental hibiscus, not the hibiscus you drink. Don't go drinking your hibiscus. I've done a video in the past. If I find it, I'll put a link down there on my red hibiscus. It grows beautifully. You can eat the leaves, high in vitamin C. So I have some out there, but I'm too lazy to get the rose, the, the buds, because you make tea out of the buds. One day I will, one day. So I like this one. And sometimes I add a lemon ginger um, tea bag in there too when I'm 
doing this and it's pink it's a pink it reminds me of fruit punch so this is how I am getting my all of my liquids trying to get it so I can flush all this sinus stuff out because I'm sure y'all are tired of me coughing going <laughs> through my videos but I'm still making videos so I don't know if like by Wednesday I will have figured out if I'm gonna go to Weight Watchers or if I'm gonna go to doing Trim Healthy Mama. I heard Weight Watchers is not so anal about the fat anymore. Like they got a new program and I got a girlfriend doing it and she's like, there's more points. And I'm just like, oh, that's just more to calculate. But she's like, I do it all on my phone and all of this. And I'm like, I don't know. I don't know. It's tempting because it's like you can do three months for $30. I think there's like a special right now going on for three months for $30. So I'm like, as long as my attention span lasts, we could do three months. Just three months because I don't know if I could do longer than that. I might be a little ADD. Um, some days I wonder because when I was in college, everybody would go to the library and study and I'd sit in there and I like could not focus. I had to like burrow myself into my apartment. That's why I had to live alone because it was the only way I could focus. Anyway, that's it, you know, and I've noticed too. I know I get so, and you don't wanna to be too skinny in your face. You're too skinny in your face, you look old. But you don't want to be skinnier. I think it's because I should show you if I could find some pictures. My like in my youthfulness, like it or not, I had a very round face, and I always felt if you have a round face, it's hard to get over the fact that you have a round face and you're not pudgy. Because I always thought I was pudgy because I had this circular face. My sister has a very circular face, so. I guess I get hypercritical on my face, and I shouldn't, because that's just ridiculous. But you know, we do. <coughs> Some of us like, do I got jaws growing? And I mean, I didn't have jaws then, but it, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just badgering now, blabbering. Tell me how you're doing. <laughs> Um, if you're making good girl moonshine, tell me your variations. I need them. I need to know about them. Um, I'm just mixing herbal teas, caffeine herbal teas. I get my caffeine and my coffee, and then I try not to drink any more caffeine the rest of the day. And I don't know, if you're doing the Weight Watchers program online, tell me how it's going. I'm very curious. <coughs> um... I don't know, but it's 30 bucks. It's another 30 bucks. I'm trying not to spend any money. And like, I've been like cruising Amazon. Be careful. I'm cruising Amazon, so instead of buying it, I'm just like, hmm, I'll post it on Facebook. I'll feel like I bought it, but I didn't buy it. But I've been tempted, like the notebooks. Okay, anyways, I'm jabbering. I better go. You probably have stuff to do. I got stuff to do. I'll talk to you later. Peace out.